Hi students, welcome to Time Institute. So today we will discuss a sum from uh, Thermodynamics, uh, NEET 2021 question paper, the bracket and the question. So let us see what the question is. A cup of coffee cools from uh, 90 degrees Celsius to 80 degrees Celsius in few minutes. Uh, room temperature under 20 degrees Celsius. Okay. Uh, now the time taken by the same cup of coffee to cool from 80 degree to 60 degree Celsius. 80 to 60 hour, every time hour will get done. And then the given temperature, the same 20 degree Celsius. Surrounding temperature, rooms temperature under 20 degree Celsius. Okay. So options put to come. All options are there. We'll see. So, mudha vishe enna bina. Is this the first time that such a question is being asked? In the question, enna first time ke karanga bina. Ille. Let us see. Pata bina liquid cools from. Abin ke karanga 70 to 60 degree Celsius. Five minutes lagve. Adi a under 60 to 50 degree aga. Tere oru minutes aga. Abin ke karanga less than five minutes aga. Greater than five minutes aga. Abin ke. So, the 92 to 2096 moon wadi ke karanga. Very very interesting summations. Similarly, a one more question. If you look at this question, you can get a cup of coffee from 80 degrees to 60 degrees Celsius in 1 minute. Ambient temperature, of course, ambient temperature is surrounding temperature. So, you can get a cup of coffee from 30 degrees Celsius. In cooling from 60 to 50, first 80 to 60, 5 minutes, 1 minute, sorry. In cooling from 60 to 50, you can get a cup of coffee from 60 to 50 degrees Celsius. Uh, in cooling from 60 to 50, again it is, uh, it was asked in 1995, 2000 and so on, right? 2002 also it was asked. So let us see, need 2021, like get a question paper, every point of So it's done question, already part of the cup of coffee goes from 90 to 80. So this is the of the general method, as usual, or general method, general every point of view. Now time way of doing, it. what is our way of doing, I think that's all. So in the sum, we have Newton's law of cooling, which is done by So as far as Newton's law of cooling, I don't know. So formula use is Newton's law of cooling. Theta 2 minus theta 1 by t is equal to k into theta 1 plus theta 2 by 2 minus theta 0. In the theta 0, we have the sundering temperature. Theta 1 and theta 2 are the initial temperature and final temperature. Okay, you got it. Okay, now getting to that in the question, every point one. Case one, first case, let us see. 90 learn 80. 90 minus 80 by t is equal to k into 90 plus 80 by 2 minus theta 0. Theta 0 is 20 degree. We have 90 plus 80 is 170 so 10 by t is equal to 10 by t is equal to k into 65 second case temperature pathing up in a 80 to 60 were the 80 to 60 by t is equal to 80 plus 60 140 by 2 minus 20 so this is a simplify panel simplify panel and our in power so 20 by t dash more than the temperature on the question they put in the net t of the 20 by t dash is equal to k into 50 Okay, so equating both the sums, <coughs> equations equate for now, we get the answer as t dash is equal to 13 by 5 times t. So this is the general way of doing, but if we do it, we will not do it, I will tell you what is the other way of doing. In one question, they are going to give you one minute, right? 180 minutes or 180 questions, for each and every question, they are going to give you only one minute. Oh. So 10 degrees square, t minutes, then 20 degrees square, how many minutes? It should be 2t. So, 10 degree, 5 seconds, 20 degree, 20 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, like that. So, 10 degree, 10 minutes, 20 degree, it will definitely take 2 T minutes. But the thing is, surrounding temperature, we have a difference, rate of cooling, okay? So, if we have a surrounding temperature, we have 100 degree Celsius, we have a surrounding temperature, 20, we have a heat loss. If we have a surrounding temperature, 20 degree, we have a heat loss, we have a slow. So, that's the reason. If you look at this, it has 2T. So, 10 degrees to T minutes, 20 degrees to 2T minutes, 2T. Option A, B, C, 15 by 13, 2 is coming. If you look at the denominator, it is coming. If you look at the denominator, it is coming. Option 2 is 13 by 10, 1.3 is coming. Option 4 is 10 by 13, that is again 1 is coming. So, ultimately, only option what I got is 13 by 5. 13 by 5 is 13 by 5 is more than 2. 13 by 5 into t is more than 2t. And this should be the right answer. So the right answer will be option C. Right? Sir, if you want to do this, you can clear all those things. If you want to do this, you can clear all those things. And one more thing, if you want to do this, you can do this. If you want to do this, you can do this. If you want to do this, you can do this. If you want to do this, you can do this. So all the best guys. Do well. Thank you. I hope you have liked the video. Please like and share.